Perhaps I should have left you on the floor to rot. Girl! She's savage. Hello! Hello. Welcome to A Story Worth Telling, where of course you know what we do. We review LGBTQ plus media representation. Woohoo! And today is no exception. No, it's not. We've finally got Mary and George. Mary. Mary. We've been looking forward to this one for a while. It's been building up. We know everyone's getting excited. And you know, we like to do a bit of period queer watching. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we do. Yes, we yes, do. Yes, we do. It doesn't sound right, does it? No. no we, <laughs> we don't really have a choice. I mean, that seems to be the genre of the moment. It uh, is. Period Everything stuff. is very, hey, let's talk about gays Listoire. in the past. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. A a, and I like that king. because I, I feel like I'm that. learning something as well. <clears throat> you know, I'm not just watching well, okay. Nicholas Gazeltine take his shorts off. I'm also getting educated. I think he's probably taking off his breeches. I feel like there's, that's, Ooh, a, that's a period thing. Yes. A lot of this history has been very straight washed for centuries, right? I feel like now we're like, you know, we're, we're taking a little bit more of a look into things, especially through the queer perspective, and we're going, oh, actually, you know what? Yeah. Sexuality, gender, all these things are a lot different to what we think we've been told. So I think, if anything, this could be, for all we know, and we don't <laughs> know because we're not historians, but a little bit more accurate. You think? <laughs> If you want to find out more about who we are, what we do, and what we might have for you, then you can um, buy some merch. Mm -hmm. It's very nice. Yeah. All the links yeah. down below. Um, and consider joining our Patreon, and you'll see all the goops and gags and shocks and frolics. And, and all the scenes. And all the scenes. I don't think, do we ever like cover Someone anything? Someone said he sleeps with 17 people. Well, that's a spoiler. Thanks for that. Who dropped him? Sort of both of us. Sort of one if you pick him up. Yes, my lady. <laughs> Perhaps I should have left you on the floor to rot. <gasps> Girl! Do you know why? Because you ruined my You are my second son. Oh. Heir and a spare. And he was a spare in Red, White and Royal Blue too. Oh yeah. So Nick is just very into being sloppy second. <laughs> he is my George. Oh. That is a, that is a fresh looking baby. Now is Nick. Well, the thing is, you don't know how Georgia. old they are, right? Because, like, ages ago, they used to do films. Half time. <gasps> oh my god! Trigger warning. Bit late for that. What the hell? Good morning, George. <laughs> what? I guess like... she finally cut the cord, hey? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you apply it. <laughs> well, why can John stay, Mother? Because he's the eldest. And I prefer him. By quite the margin. She's savage. I don't want to go. All I want is Jenny. I love her. She's a servant. You just want to send me off to France to learn the ways of refinement. And then return to marry some awful rich wife and milk her fat fucking dowry. Father has enough I'm times, dead. why don't you? <laughs> Mother, don't hurt him. <laughs> She's a bit of me, not yeah. gonna lie. <laughs> if I get fucked up in an argument and I'm not winning, I'm just gonna go <laughs> It's like centered in history, but it's not like, um... Yeah, I'm sure, I'm sure that they didn't have, you know... It's quite sure like a modern that. scripting in a way. I feel like I'm watching a BBC drama. <laughs> Like, it's a bit that. If I were a man, and I looked like you, I'd rule the fucking planet. I don't want to rule the fucking planet. Then it will rule you. Okay, well, father's <laughs> dead. Oh, it's quite and dark. Christ, it's, this was an opening and a half. It's quite dark humor. Get rid of him. No rakes. Oh, no, he, was a, he was like a knob. Him. Okay, fine. Like yeah. Girl, bye. In the ground. A serving girl with nothing. And like a fool, I paid off the bowmans so they would lie. Arse. Okay, so everyone's just had, like, not a great start in life. <laughs> but, you know, as the saying goes, you can only go up. 
Is that what the saying is? Yeah. I think there are plenty of other sayings that we could choose from. <laughs> and you choose my money to send that little tart to France. I will. I went so good money after bad. And my daughter will go to France and learn a better way than yours. Any more to share? Yeah, down the stairs, love. <laughs> okay. Oh, they're down the stairs. Reminds me of that song. I threw Josh shit into a bag and shut it down the stairs. <laughs> Your husband signed over your house to one of his cousins. I think to insulate it from his debt. What a dick! The reason for payment is specified there. If this became known, your position in society would it's become untenable. I feel like you could just do that back then. You know, because nowadays everything's yeah, like it's... online. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> back then, I'd be like, oh! <laughs> What do I do for capital? There's only one option. Marry again. Is there any worse hell than a woman? Oh, it's an owl mask. <laughs> oh, maybe it's like a kink name. Sir Thomas Compton. I'm afraid so. You? Your next wife. Sorry, love. Don't be. What is this? I know. I know you are self-made. I want none of your fortune, no rights of acquisition. You are forward. I have been held back far too long. It used to be like nothing holds you back, like you used to get what you want. No, quite the opposite. And you should know, I am Mary. I'm seduced. Mary had a little plan. <laughs> <laughs> I've never been out to sea. My French is so sans. I I'll you never. You have nothing to fear in France. But if you miss this chance, you'll fail us all and live like your father. Smear the unwashable excrement of eternal shame. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, Julianne! Great. Mary, yes. you got Great. to be a better mother. I oh, know, I love it. It's like tough love. Love it. How can I help you if I don't know who you are? Oh, uh, they are so definitely going to sleep together. It's not right to me. Oh, come on. Oh, Look at that how feathered are you hat. To me? It's spoiled, I think. Nick? I mean, yeah. George. Yeah. Oh, they're busy. I'm staying. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. You couldn't pay me to go home. Uh. Don't know why I hadn't gone sooner. OMG. Did you take me through that on purpose? To humiliate me? Ah, mais non. Non, mais il n'y a que deux chemins qui mènent dans votre chambre. On your body. You're tethering. No, I like the sound of that. <laughs> own your What's body. That? It's me owning my body. <laughs> From now on, no more English. It is like a um, disease of the tongue. <laughs> Sure you get past this level. <laughs> Excuse me? Who did the Beyonce dance better? On, so he's learning dancing, fencing. fencing, and sexing. Well, we don't know about the sexing yet. He's definitely learning that. <laughs> I would say, you're right, those aren't, that I think those aren't skills to be a man of the house. Those are skills to be a fabulous human being. <laughs> well rounded human. <laughs> well rounded. <laughs> must I have never met the king. I should like to, for once in my life. Well, I fear you've got one too few penises and two too many tits. Well, I know about the king's taste, but still, I'd enjoy the privilege. You should always wear a strap. There are some things where you just think, maybe I just shouldn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying! Look, you don't say no to royalty. Well, unless it's Camilla. <laughs> No one likes her. <laughs> it's a kind of fun way that they refer to the king here in just like, oh yes, we know what he likes. But it's not being like, oh, he's a like deviant, like... Yeah. It's just kind know. of brushed over in a very yeah. like... I like it. And I think that's what we're going to see more in this series is that like the way people's sexual interests and sexualities are probably spoken about is a lot more just kind of like less of an issue 
and more of a just sort of like it's a thing it's a thing but it is it's all about like <laughs> it's power and status and that's all that she clearly gives a shit about and fair enough she doesn't mind who she sleeps with exactly yeah. as long as she gets power the well hung crew men of the king's bedchamber all scots crew oh my god it's like the pit crew from drag race oh scottish crew <laughs> Oh. Okay. All of you inside. Oh, so that's the one he's currently. Mm -hmm. King James is tired. Does not want to see anyone. Damn, he is fit. He is fucking hot. He could be my bed chamber man. Oh, the king is more tired than we thought. He may, in fact, be very ill. As such, he does not want to die. But may you stay a while with us, and we converse with you, my lord. No. <laughs> Oh, he's a bitchy gay. <clears throat> what are you doing? Are you a spy? Wherever I am is my property for the king's business. You are so handsome. Mm-hmm. But you must be terrified now. His head will turn one day for another more beautiful. Look. Your majesty. Now, where were we before all those rash, silly words? Must we fight like cats? We should play like pups. Getting into some pup play. Is he a bit kinky? I said this was kinky. Mm. All for show. I don't know. Why is he peeking from the corner? Because everyone is into yes. it. <laughs> <laughs> Woof. I think we know where doggy masks came from now. Surly sodomite Somerset and his Scottish seamen guzzlers. So you would prefer we were ruled by our own plucky homegrown. What a sentence that was. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of alliteration there. I feel like everything I said earlier. Maybe I <laughs> this show is not holding back. No. But I love that. And also the fact that like it's it's showing that people just weren't afraid to be that outwardly brazen. Like it's interesting yeah. that. You watch something where you've got like the king and his his privy councillor man just like kind of kissing in the middle of a hallway in front of two guards in front of her, and then you compare it to like a film like Red, White, and Royal Blue, which is set in our time, and yet most of that film they were like hiding behind closed doors. behind closed doors, yeah. and like the complete reversal of what you know years do in history does, and it's like. Well, I think I think it did kind of come in waves. Yeah, there, it there does. Was a, there was yeah. a period where it was kind of normalized and not really, not really. An and issue. I love and seeing that difference issue, in in things back. that we watch, though, because I feel mm -hmm. like it just kind of opens that. Oh, of course, like you can use that as a sort of. Oh, okay. And why are we where we are now with this? Okay. And this is the weird thing because I read about this in one of my books, Bad Gays. Great book to watch, to read, by the way, because it talks about all the bad gays mm. in history instead of the ones that we like remember for being big. And he, obviously, about the same James, we know James was like incredibly boys, 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 but he then decided to write the King James Bible, which essentially condemns homosexual relations hugely. And it's like the Bible that we go off mainly here, and it's like incredibly anti gay. Weird. Yeah, but it's power play. It's like the idea that I can do it. But you can't. But you can't. Mm. Mm -hmm. yeah. Your leg slip. What's some saying, Lavinia? Blair. Penis. Mais c'est un homme. And? Il dit une classe en fait Oui, enfin, ce dernier point ne t'a pas vraiment dérangé jusque là. Girl, shut the door, go inside, have some fun. Ooh, I mean, he just likes watching. Oh, I like that. Yeah, it's a little bit far away from love is love, isn't it? All the world's bodies a body. are just bodies. <laughs> <laughs> Dive on in, girl. Yeah. Booty. I guess we don't have underwear. Well. I can complete. say his education is now <laughs> fun, lads. He has a degree in. Korean <laughs> Savat. He was the only one that was hung up on it being a man, but everyone else is the is the issue is the class thing. I think. Mm. I like drafts. Good. Me too. 
I like turtles. My son's not due back for another week. Do you miss me? Oh, he's different. Oh. Uh. Oh, he's come back a changed man. One night with Ooh. one night with two men, and I tell you, it is transformative. That's like two I men. Yeah, two <laughs> men can change you. You know, I remember my first time as well. The next day, I felt like a RuPaul on a runway. Slay. Yeah. And the following day, I got tested. But <laughs> unimpressive. What's he like, James? Interesting. He's like, he's like, I know how to play the game now. Yeah. I can see what you've been doing. Will you find me a wife? I'm sure you have just a girl in mind. Mm, I think we aim higher. You want me to hold a man's cup while he swallows? I'll leave the specifics to you, but it's not a man. It's a king. <laughs> What a husband. You should be deliberately. Don't you dare talk oh. back to the woman who shares my bed. You'll be silent and still, or it'll be a massacre. Jesus. The other boy did trip him. So his own justice. There was no need to implement more. All is done, Your Majesty. <laughs> Oh, that was his one opportunity there. Yeah, his girl. one opportunity. Second sons are usually a waste of life, and yet I knew as I held you with your grace and light, I might raise you up. She's being very motherly now, I she think. She is. Kings do not pardon men for crimes done in their sight against their lover's say, unless they yearn for them you. Mm. He saw you, and he will think of you tonight as he sleeps. He tried love, George. He will be yours. Mine. Ours. Mmm. Schemes. Ooh. Okay, girl. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I love it. I'm sold. <laughs> you, you're in it? I'm in it. We haven't seen any raunchy, raunchy yet. Oh, we're getting there. And it's got men's. And also, it's got really hot people. Yeah. I, which uh... isn't everything. But it's a, it's something. What is something? <laughs> <laughs> I guess you know we're seeing we're seeing some interesting representation. Yes, which is nice. Absolutely. I'm excited to see where it goes. But we're seeing like a really laid back approach to an emphasis on <laughs> sexuality, and I love that because I feel like I've watched things about this time, this period in history, and it's always been either completely ignored any form of queerness. Or when there has been queerness shown, it's like absolutely scandalized it. But now it's just like it's social money. Like everyone's doing it. Body's a body. Body's a body. I love that. I might put that on a t-shirt. I just yeah. don't think that's the right message. No, really, I so. agree. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, oh. that's fabulous, and we cannot wait to do the yeah. rest. We'll see you very shortly for the second episode. Bye. Mm.